Hello and welcome to another tour of Hotman Productions Artistic Environment. We begin with the Shrine to the Electric Typewriter. The last typewriter we had to remember it. Shells, beads, a little grotto for the goddess, and course, a couple of wonderful gnomes. At Hatman Productions, you never know when a gnome will be found. If you look closely, there's one lurking there in the underbrush. There he is, the gnome of the front yard hedge. Well, as we turn slowly sideways here, past the shrine and out the front gate, we can see the art car. And there we have Eve. Eve is falling out of the Garden of Eden. She is a mannequin made of fiberglass on the side of the truck. Now we shall walk down toward the car to get a better look. Now, there she is. There's Eve. You can tell there she is, falling out of the Garden Eden. Clutching, clutching at a set of clothing and with one hand the terrible apple which of course was given to her by the serpent. You can see the serpent right there. Most of the car used to be magnets. These are magnets that we designed to stay on the car in all kinds of speeds and traffic. Another feature of our car a magnet truck is brass instruments and Santas. So we shall visit them. And as we set up here, sorry for the quick move, but that's how it is sometimes. You see the front of the truck has Santas. It is really a Santa sleigh. There's a funny little person there with soldiers for hair. And down at the bottom, well, the Barbies are getting a good ride, along with the gnome on a gas pump handle. There you are. Oops, there's my shadow. Oh, that's nice. There's Adam. Adam also is coming out of the Garden of Eden. And you can see him there. His face is a bit bright as it is white and it is sunny today. But he is being expelled from the Garden of Eden out of the big apple tree. Poof! And there he goes. Up on top, let's see some of the brass instruments and other artwork. There's a whole alphorn up there. Let's go to the back of the truck now. Of course, on any story of the Garden of Eden, you need God. So here is God and the garden before things started to happen. Then up at the top, we have a fan with Woody on it. He's 
Toy Story. And all of his Barbies are up there. Well, onward, we'll go down the street over to Handycar. Handycar is a Grand Am shrine to the helping hand. And there's the front of Handycar. It's decorated with all kinds of things. Buttons, mannequins, hands of mannequins, and the hands of dolls. He drives every day, Handycar. He's a daily driver art car. Andrea. We think of her as a sort of goddess of helping. The car is to encourage people to help others. We'll walk around to the famous gate where Handycar lives for most of the time. We call this the sandbox gate because it is made out of two sandboxes. I'll back up for a nice shot of that. So there you have a nice gate. Sort of whimsical and fun. On the other side of the gate, this is where we put the hands, or the feet, as I should say, feet really, shouldn't I? That's the gate where we put the feet. It's a place for all the doll parts, somewhere here in the yard. So, onward we'll see the area where we work here, and then past the Guy Fox Turkey Pit. More on that later in a separate episode. The Wassail Pot, you can see that there as we are walking. So we cook the Wassail over here. Have the big pile of mulch this is this time. And here we have John, our mannequin friend John. He's next to the Val de Clavier or Woods piano. It's a piano plate with strings that plays. Well, moving past, you can see the other art car here, which we call the Soul Car. Soul Car is a 1965 Dodge Coronet covered with souls and transponders. I guess I'll leave you with that for now, as things are getting long. Hotman Productions. We drive our cars every day. We're in Linthka, Maryland, and sometimes we'll go to festivals and events. So, who knows? Maybe we'll see you at a festival 
or an event, or maybe just in the shopping center. You may contact us at cblady, C-B-L-A-D-E-Y, at verizon.net. C-B-L-A-D-E-Y, at sign verizon.net. Talk to you later. See you on the road.